Welcome to another Artemis Suite tutorial. In this tutorial, you will learn about the flexible options offered by Artemis Suite for displaying analysis results. You will learn how to customize the layout and the appearance of your diagrams. In our example, we want to compare three marks to each other by means of two analyses. For displaying analyses of multiple marks, the data viewer is a suitable destination item. All settings of a data viewer can be configured in its Properties tool window before or after a calculation. If the Properties tool window is not visible, you can display it via the View menu. A double click on the data viewer starts the calculation. By default, all results diagrams are displayed on one page. In this default mode, the layout of the diagrams is adapted dynamically. This means that depending on the settings, the number of selected marks and analyses determines the number of rows and columns in a data viewer. However, you can also display your results on several pages. To do so, you can select, for example, the setting One Page for Each Analysis. Since our example contains two analyses, the data viewer now consists of two pages. You can switch between these pages using the arrows at the top edge of the data viewer. But also if you place all your results on one page, you have a number of configuration options. First, select one page for everything. Then select one column for each mark and one row for each analysis, and you will get both analyses of all measurements displayed separately on the same page. Do you prefer a column-wise arrangement of the analyses? Select one column for each analysis. With the dynamic diagram layout functionality, in most cases you will be able to adapt the presentation of your measurement results to your requirements. However, if you analyze a measurement with a very large number of channels, the dynamic layout functionality can quickly lead to confusing results. In this case, select a fixed number of rows and columns instead in order to ensure a clearly arranged presentation of your results. In the Diagram options, you can change the appearance of your diagrams. Click on one of the diagrams and the Diagram options will appear in the Properties tool window. Here you can change, for example, the font or the diagram title. The settings will only be applied to the currently selected diagrams. A black frame indicates which diagrams are currently selected. If you want to change the appearance of several diagrams at once, select all of these diagrams while keeping the Control key pressed. The changes you make now will be applied to all selected diagrams. Under Legend, you can change the position and the font of the diagram legend. The Transparent option is particularly useful if the legend covers parts of your result curves. You can choose to display only the single number results for each channel in the legend. Besides the information automatically generated by Artemis Suite, you can also add any information from the user documentation to your diagrams if the data have been documented. The appearance of your curves, such as their color and line thickness, can be changed under Line Styles. You can also access these settings by right-clicking on one of the curves in your diagram. This allows you to quickly and easily change the appearance of individual curves. Under Abscissas and Ordinates, you can change the representation of the axes such as their placement in the diagram. You will learn more about the configuration options for axes in a separate tutorial. Your changes in the diagram options were only applied to the selected diagrams, but you can copy and paste your changes to additional diagrams. To do so, select a diagram. You can now copy a setting by right-clicking on the corresponding area in the Properties tool window. Now select one or several diagrams to which you want to apply these settings. Now right-click on the corresponding area of the Diagram Options and select Paste to apply the Line Styles setting, for example. 
This procedure can be performed for all settings of a diagram at once or, as shown before, for specific settings only. To copy all settings of a diagram, right-click on the Diagram Options title. That way, you can transfer your settings not only from one diagram to another, but also from a diagram to a destination pool item, such as a data viewer, and vice versa. The settings shown so far only apply to the data viewer that is currently open. They are lost as soon as you close the data viewer. The function Copy Data Viewer allows you to save your diagram settings for future analyses. That way, the data viewer settings are no longer lost and can be reused for future calculations. Copy and paste the data viewer to your pool favorites and you can access it independently of your current project. Now you have an overview of the layout possibilities for your analysis results. You know how to configure your diagrams the way you want and how to transfer and save these settings.